Probably that it is so different from most of the European languages that people learn. It's kind of fun feeling like you can almost speak a code that, uh, and you can even read something that most people can't even read at all. Привет, меня зовут Dylan, which means, hi, my name is Dylan in Russian. I speak English and Russian. I've been studying Russian for about eight years. Bits and pieces I would get from her while living with her, and then it just, when I saw I could take it in high school, I decided I wanted to take something different, and I figured I could try, you know, speaking at home with my mom, and decided on Russian. I think sometimes some of them have been a little puzzled, mostly due to stereotypes, but most of them are pretty impressed with the language choice that I made and they all agree that it's definitely useful, especially in the area that we live in. Uh, they've been a lot more structured, uh, a lot more rigorous. The instruction has been a lot better. Instructors have been more consistent. Uh, in my high school years I had a different instructor every year because every year the school was trying to cut the program unsuccessfully. I'd say it only took me about two to three weeks to really master it and be able to just sound out any word I see. A lot of people give it, you know, make it seem like a really difficult task when they first see it and think they could never do it, but it's really quick to do. I mean, ideally, I'd go into politics in some fashion and maybe use it as an analyst or an advisor. Um, I could go into diplomacy. I've toying with the idea of the Foreign Service. Um, it opens up tons of job opportunities. I was even talking to my Russian friend in Moscow the other day, and he was saying how it could be valuable simply by the fact that in trying to learn and understand this culture, I show an actual true interest in it, which employers over there would find valuable. It's not many Americans actually try to do that. My goal would be, if in an ideal situation, to create a system in which we actually write portions of their school textbooks to teach to their children, and they do the same for us so that there's no, wrong, wrongfully taught history has caused multiple wars, and I think it would be extremely beneficial to do that. It's actually something that France and Germany do. Mm -hmm.